All right, welcome back everybody. Dr. Blumenthal back here in the Bethesda office with Natural Transplants. And this morning we have John here. John has joined us from up in New York. Formerly DC, now New York. New York, okay, great. Um, so John, just quick, tell us about sort of your journey, what brought you to us and uh, how you found us. Sure, so uh, I have been searching uh, over the past couple of years for uh, the, I don't know, best uh, transplant sort of solution to fit my needs. Mm -hmm. um, and one thing that really attracted me to natural transplants was number one, the honesty of the doctors. Um, they're not trying to sell you on something, um, but also uh, how realistic uh, they are with you about what results uh, look like. Um, so that was really helpful for me in determining whether I wanted to go with a few versus a FUT, mm -hmm. um, and sort of the benefits of each mm -hmm. uh, and the difference mm -hmm. in how I'm setting myself up for sort of a long-term result. Awesome, awesome. And I think you, you sort of got that long-term in mind and just in case you need a second procedure and all that sort of we've talked about, yep. uh, which is great. So if you don't mind, I'm, I'm just gonna kind of pull your hair back just so we can kind of see what we're working with. And you've always, you, you said, you shared with me, you've always kind of had more of a pointed hairline, but things have gotten, you know, more more recession as time goes on, as it happens to all of us. And so what we're gonna do today is kind of round this off so it's not quite as pointy. May, and we'll, after we draw it on, we may reinforce the, um, temples as well too. We'll sort of draw it out and see what we like. Um, so that's the goal today, we'll kind of fill it in. Okay everybody, we are back with John and we have drawn out all our lines here. Let me show you what we got. So we're just gonna subtly, gonna keep the hairline pretty much where it was. I shaved just a touch, but obviously we're gonna kind of round off the edges so we're not dealing with quite as much recession. And we brought in the temples just a little bit, just sort of angled them up. Instead of angling back, we just kind of angled them up just slightly. And it gives a nice, strong appearance and still a little bit of recession in there, which is not bad. Um, again, it's, it's more of a natural look. Uh, I think it looks good. What do you think, man? Let's do it. You good? Ready? You ready? ready? All right, so we're not doing any volume today. No. We can go with it. We're pretty fire. mellow, pretty relaxed. Yeah. Uh, we'll get going and we'll check in with you a little later. Great. Cool. Awesome. Um, I would say that, again, you know, I think I said this in the first uh, video we took, but, um, you know, having uh, a doctor be honest um, mm -hmm. with you uh, about expectations and about results uh, is, to me, made a huge difference yeah. um, cool. between deciding not only between a few and an FUT, but, you know, choosing, you know, the right doctor. And yeah. so, yeah. Um, you know, I highly recommend uh, natural transplants. Awesome. And, uh, if anybody's considering, and I'm, I'm like very excited to see the results. <laughs> I know. Uh, so it'll so, just sometimes be sometimes the hardest part is the waiting. Yeah, you know, uh, honestly, yeah. The Trying healing, to be patient, being let waiting. the healing begin. Right, uh, exactly. And uh, yeah, and I'm I'm looking forward to you cool. know having another video and, and same timing awesome. from uh, from yeah. New York with the yeah. results. Yeah, absolutely. And we'll check in with you usually like four months, nine months in a year, and hopefully we'll we'll see that year mark and, and you know it'd be awesome. We we'll love it. All right, what is up everybody? Dr. Blumenthal here, natural transplants in the Bethesda office, and we have John. John, good to see you, man. We're one year out from the surgery. Good to see you too. Congrats, what? dude. You, you, look, you look amazing. You, like I was saying, you look like a model kind of walking around with wavy hair. Um, yeah. t t tell me how the last year went. Good, bad, all the above. Uh, well, I think everybody's had quite a crazy year this year. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I think that's a as an understatement. Yeah. Hey, uh, we'll, we'll focus to the hair related hair related yeah. issues. How about that? All right. Uh, but I think, uh, no, I mean, what, what a better time to have a hair transplant. Yeah. I, I think I timed that, uh, perfectly. That you did. We, you know, we went into lockdown here in New York, uh, not yeah. too, you know, almost shortly after, uh, yeah. I had it. So, uh, so but yeah, I mean, uh, crazy to see, uh, I mean, I actually haven't looked at the before and after pictures, uh -huh. but even just, uh, to sort of have, the hairline back uh, has just been absolutely unbelievable. I've yeah. gotten so many comments from the somewhat people I, I haven't seen in a while, uh -huh. but uh, you know, yeah. uh, that's limited right, uh, right. To, to family these days. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's just it's just amazing awesome. to to see the growth and uh, and how natural and you know, I I just would have never thought it would have been you know turned out like this yeah, uh, yeah. I guess. it looks fantastic and you, you got great hair for this as well too so it, it really works out well for you um you said no issues with the back your barber was looking couldn't find it 
You haven't had yeah, any, I mean, I, haven't had any yeah, pain have, or anything? No, I had my coronavirus hair going for a while. Right. Uh, so I got it cut uh, not too long ago here. Uh, and he couldn't even see the, you, I mean, you know, you'd really have to look. Cool. Uh, he said to sort of like see it and he awesome it's grown it's grown out a little bit on the side since i got a cut but yeah. it was even shorter yeah uh you know and i i forget what the actual length he used to fade it but yeah. uh yeah you Not can't issue. tell unless you're really close and really looking for good. it good good so do, do me a favor i'm gonna have you just look down and hold it for about three seconds then what we're gonna do and just kind of just pull your hair back just with one of your hands or something like that yeah there you go and that you can kind of see um we'll just hold it there for two or three seconds then i have you turn to the right Hold it for two or three seconds, and we'll match up the before pictures and then the other direction. That looks awesome. Looks great, man. I love it. We'll send you some copies if you want. We'll put them side by side so you can see the before and afters. Yeah, uh, no, I love that. It's fantastic. I love it. Awesome, man. Any any words of advice, words of encouragement for anybody kind of wondering or on the fence? Yeah, I mean, I will say that uh, it's, you know, one thing, and I, to be honest, like, I went around and got so many different consults from so many different uh, places and people and talked and like, and and one thing I will say is that, you know, natural hair transplants, you know, and and I think I actually had consults with like you, Dr. B, I think like a couple. And then I think I got on with Dr. H as well. Uh Um, And just the, just the, the full transparency around the process uh and sort of what to expect yeah not like false promises and like false hope and like this is what you're going to look like yeah um and honestly you know the the recovery is is as expected uh it's not it's not you know you, <laughs> there are times when it's not fun absolutely exactly. yeah yeah like yeah we, we try to prepare you i think and sort of make you know like reasonable and, and, and prepare you so you sort of know what to expect but you know it, you never really know till you go through with it but you know yeah, and yeah. I think, you know, after, I would say, you know, after, like, the first maybe, like, one or two months, you're generally, like, yeah. you know, you're sort of, like, back to a... Back a to level. normal life. Yeah. yeah. Um, but, like like I said, just the full transparency and the honesty, awesome. uh, you know, made a huge difference. And then, of course, like, just the ongoing follow-up. I know I'm not local to the D.C. area anymore, but, um, yeah. you know, just sort of the ongoing follow-up and just ability to text you or call you with questions and yep. issues. Yeah. Um, you know, I think I was having some ingrown hairs here and there yeah. um, and, and being able to get a result makes such a huge difference when yeah. you're, you know, doing something like this. Good, good. Awesome, man. We, we, we loved having you as a patient. I'm so excited for your results. Really happy for you. You're smiling. Um, <laughs> yeah. s- s- send me more fun pictures of your car and you you out, you know, <laughs> in, your, in your convertible out messing around. That'd be fun, man. <laughs> awesome. I appreciate you doing this and sharing your story with everybody. It makes a big difference in, you know, patients are looking around and seeing your story and uh keep in touch will do all right john take care bye all right thanks all right. see you man yep call us now 844-327-4247 and ask about our hue and hue plus procedures which move more hair than ever before hope to hear from you soon